Hello Q and the ONR team. My name is James Edmondson. I'm a principal scientist here at Galois, and I was the lead author on the Cougars proposal for the 99 Luft Balloon competition. In the Cougars proposal, we introduce a collaborative algorithm called PORD that reacts to other adversarial teams in the competition using contextual reasoning and aggressive autonomy. To showcase our intended contributions, we hope you appreciate this video of a swarm-inspired Zeppelin scoring goals against a team of sharks. The results of the proposal will be autonomous agents that shouldn't rely on RF or IR communication. However, for the purpose of this capability demo, we want to show the type of movement dynamics we expect of helium-based dirigibles. We picked up two types of Mylar Zeppelins. The first, a shark toy that uses a caudal fin for propulsion and a ballasted pod for dive rise. And the second type of robot, a three-motor blimp with two motors producing forward-backward propulsion and turning, while the third motor provides additional lift. Neither of these designs is what we'll be using in competition, but each was fun to play with and learn from as they have different vehicle dynamics and showcase different balancing mechanisms which may inform our final designs. Our primary contributions will not be in revolutionary redesign of dirigibles, but instead in the way in which an autonomous, neutrally buoyant robotic system may act with teammates and adversaries in a competition like this, with or without RF or IR communication capability. We are specifically interested in aggressive and high-speed thrust with powerful motors and large rotors to produce enough force to maneuver adversaries away from goals and enable teammates to score goals or to catch game-ending balls when that part of the competition has opened up. We think that helping teammates to score is going to be a key ingredient for winning in our shake-and-bake recipe. Creating this kind of collaborative autonomy will involve real-time machine learning or other techniques to classify objects such as opponent vehicles, the game balls, the hoops, and the perceived intents, vectors of attack, and timing of actors within the competition area. And this includes potentially human referees or meandering observers. However, our goals will be clear. We want to be autonomous, we want to be aggressive, and we want to go fast. 